Okay, this is my grow. Um, it's basically a, a metal shelf with the uh, LED grow lamp uh, with some Reflectix that I had uh, from the uh, the back room. Took it out, just wrapped it around. And inside, we've got the plants, and in the the center tub, the five different types of lettuce um, planted on a, about the 29th of October, which is um, about five days ago. Two of them were planted like a day or two later, so they're doing pretty good. I'll zoom in here real quick. Um, you see we're getting the extra leaves on them. It's amazing you come in here. Um, you know, now we come back later in the evening, you come back tomorrow morning. It's amazing to see the plant growth, but getting five different types of lettuce, getting their uh, first, I guess, tree leaves. Over here, um, in the individual, like, uh, soda bottles that were cut open with a um, net cup dropped in there the rock wall and a little bit of um, gravel put around it we've got um, Swiss chard in the back and kale in the front I should have probably let them seed uh, or um, sprout a little longer in the the tray to get the root to come out the bottom because it's not there yet but I figure since we got leaves and everything we might as well just let them continue to seed over here and maybe get a benefit from the light or something so we'll see how that works. And over here we've got over here we've got our um, cat grass, a mixture of like rye, barley, those types of things in the back. Uh, the growth on those things is phenomenal. The ones in the back have literally doubled their size like every day. Um, the ones in the front are just starting to come up, and they're already literally double the size they were last night when I put them in here. So it's amazing. The empty one in the front's got a really, really super small um, catnip plant growing up out of the middle. It's probably impossible to see, but that's what we got going on right now. Um, super excited to see the lettuce come in. See what we got there, and then the uh, the kale and the Swiss chard should be absolutely beautiful because it's um, a red and a, a blue color. So it should be absolutely beautiful. Anyway, we're out for today.